I believe that we're going to see a move of God that's going to shake nations. Where whole nations will bow their knee in a day. Who is ready to raise the bar to the next level? I mean the deep in me is calling out for mega power. Calling out for mega grace. Awesome. Come on, let's just walk. Come on, let's just see what God's doing. Come on. Come on, someone help. Come on, someone help. Her. Come on. I have had bone to bone arthritis on my knees for years now, since about 2010. So you touched me <laughs> Sunday morning. I ran around this church, y'all. I have not had to put this brace back on my leg. I have had no pain. Yes. Come on, look at her go. Hey. Hey, 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 someone help her tonight. Come on, come on, help her. Come on. I've been having like bad pains for like a couple of months. Really? Watch this. Watch this. Okay. See? See how your feet are off? You see that? So watch this. So in Jesus' name, you know, they grow. See it? Yeah, Joe. <laughs> yeah, my. <laughs> you see that? I didn't pull it, down. Did it's great, no. I didn't pull it, yeah. Ah. Now, jump down now. Now check your back and your hip. Nothing hurts no more. No, hurt no more. No huh? hurt no more. <laughs> hey. Hey. I've been having leg, major leg pain for probably close to two weeks. Uh, hardly ever. I haven't hardly been able to walk, mm -hmm. needing assistance really a lot of times. Wow. Um, just kind of limping around pretty bad. And uh, I went up for prayer tonight expecting a miracle. Got laid, uh, my hands laid on and it just happened. Wow. I started running around the church, so. <laughs> Look at this. And you couldn't do that when you came? No, I could barely walk. <laughs> well, praise Jesus, hey? It's awesome. And so what was wrong? You had spinal stenosis or yes. something? So what I does that what does that mean? To be paralyzed totally. Wow. Um, they couldn't give me surgery because they uh, was uh, not sure if I was to survive the surgery. Oh. So my life was a wheelchair, walking chair, crutches. Yeah. Uh, and it helped everything. Yeah. Painful? Painful, yes. Is it painful? Yeah. 24 hours a day. Is it? I only sleep one or two hours. Oh. And then I go walk around, sit, and uh, it's a terrible life. Yeah. When I walk from uh, forward to you, yeah, uh, I, I have a strange feeling. Yeah. And uh, it was uh, like, uh, oh my God, no, I began to cry. Yeah. You know? And I grabbed this wall. Yeah, I saw that. Hang on. Yeah. Uh, usually I can walk uh, four or five meters yeah uh, suddenly my pain was gone yeah i can't feel a thing <laughs> yeah it's that's strange. awesome but you took off running tonight we saw yeah, you running a, up and down I haven't <laughs> run for 40 years you haven't run for 40 no. years wow wow initially when things got really bad was 2007 you know i was diagnosed with a genetic form of muscular dystrophy that came from my mother's side. It kind of started in my lower extremities mostly and then kind of moved up um, and then uh, started getting some of the autonomic uh, problems. I, I was gonna die. Medicine had no more answers. The only one that can fix this is God. I mean because that whole process it wasn't just physically killing me it was killing my soul. The first thing he literally said that night, which was pretty mind-blowing to me because there's no way you can know that. He said it was like a bacterial parasite and it was in this area. Um, and I mean, essentially, that is exactly what was killing me. Um, and actually, my urostomy is right here because I don't have a bladder. And one specific moment, like I remember, is uh, one time put his hand on the top of my head and he's like, Holy Spirit, fill her head to toe, head to toe, Holy Spirit, fill her head to toe. Um, and uh, literally like at that moment, um, it was like, I felt like this like really powerful, um, but at the same time, it's like complete peacefulness. 
I don't know, just, um, and uh, love. And it literally felt like it went from the top of my head through my toe. Um, and it was like I could see it even though it was inside of me. And he's like, okay, walk. And you know, the first few steps, like my muscle spasms were kind of bad and stuff. But I'll tell you, like, I wasn't, um, like it was like with each step, like, um, it got stronger and stronger. Like, um, it was a very overwhelming feeling. I mean, when I left the church that night, I didn't use the wheelchair. I mean, like the wheel, I did not leave in the wheelchair. So first time you walked in 10 years, yeah. how does it feel now? You're not shaking as much, right? No, no, it's just, I don't know, free. Like, I mean, though, I could maybe go 50 feet with forearm crutches wow. without, you know, sitting down or whatnot. Beautiful, beautiful. That's awesome, right? So, Is that a great they miracle? They said they, I would never walk again. Awesome. Yeah, now you've been to the doctors since then. What did they think when they saw you walk in, not wheeling? I think they were like, Angie? <laughs> Where's your wheelchair? <laughs> each one so it's about 400 tests and uh everything was completely normal yeah!